It's more than password, it's password plus. Our guest stars from Angie, Deborah Lee Scott, and from One in a Million, Richard Paul. And here's the star of Password Plus, Alan Wang. Thank you. Glad you're with us. We've got two good Password Plus players here for a whole week. Have you all ever played together? No. You've no. never competed? Not, would, not on, not I on. I'll tell show. you this, Richard. She's a fierce fighter. I know her well. She, she is. She's fierce. She's, she's smart. She's a lousy loser. She hates <laughs> yes, to lose. Yes, I hate him. She hates to lose. I want you to meet your current players right now: Billy Stransky and Lois Parker. Come in. <laughs> Billy Stransky, first star champion. Billy Stransky over here is our current champion. She has $2,200 oh. plus $100 in the current game. Now, remind us again about you, Billy. I'm from Wichita, Kansas, and uh, I have three grown children and two beautiful grandchildren. And uh, my husband and I have lived in Wichita for about 20 years. I'm a retired teacher of uh, deaf children and teacher of sign language. And a lovely necklace. You have a beautiful necklace. Thank you. Very Thank nice. You. Now, let's meet this challenger over here, Lois Parker. Remind I'm, us again about you, Lois. I'm from Seattle, Washington. I'm married, and I have a little girl, one and a half, Autumn. And I'm an instructor and a consultant at a health spa. Good to have you here, Lois. I got to tell you, we've been having some very good players from Seattle lately. So, now this is the situation. 100 over here, 100 over here, $200 puzzle here. Whoever wins this puzzle goes right <laughs> down the bettings, which is the way I like to start Monday. Here we go. What are you gonna do, Richard? Pass or play? Up to me, eh? Yeah, pass or play? Uh, pass. Okay, Deborah Lee. Can I pass it back? No. Nope. Okay. Um, beard, goatee. Second clue. Handlebar. Mustache. All I right. I knew you were gonna do that. I don't think handlebar was in the first clue. No, that should have hey. said no. Uh, All right, Billy. First clue in the puzzle and for the game. Mustache. What do you think? Um. Uh, B.J. Honeycutt. What? B.J. Honeycutt. He has a mustache. Who is he? Oh, he has the, the, the food oh, and fuel store. Oh, oh. that's right. B.J. Cool. Oh, Honeycutt. Oh, oh, and Matt. Is it B.J. Honeycutt? No. <laughs> what could have been? No. And I watch that show all the time. All right. Richard has the option. B.J. Honeycutt. Well, I knew it wasn't my husband. He had a mustache, too. Could have been. Um, Richard, pass or pass? Pass. Okay. Chicken. <laughs> No extra clues. <laughs> Walk. Say it again, please. Walk. Strut. Second clue, Richard. Duck. Waddle. Right. Well, you know how to pass. <laughs> he certainly does know how to pass. Watch him now. Oh. Now you have two clues up there. Mustache and waddle. What do you think, Billy, for the game? Is it Groucho Marx? Is it Groucho Marx? I never thought about that, the way he walked. It could be a waddle, I guess. All right. Richard has the option. Better think of a first clue. All right. Pass or play, Richard? Um, I'll play. All right. Soapbox. Derby. Yes! Oh, my Good Now you have three clues up there. Mustache, waddle, Derby for the game, Billy. Is it Charlie Chaplin? Is it Charlie Chaplin? You won the game. Yeah. You didn't have a shot at it. All right. Lois Parker from Seattle. We have to say goodbye to you, dear, but we do so with $100 and a fine gift. I had fun. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry about this last game, but that's the way he played it. Very well. Yes. You have a is this your second alphabetics? The third alphabetics for Lois, right after this commercial. Don't go away. Billy. All right, Billy Stransky here to play your third alphabetics. Now, Billy, I'm going to ask you some questions, and I want you to sign the answers. Tell me, Billy, do you think you're going to get the $5,000 this time? You bet. <laughs> is that bet? 
Okay. Do you think he will give good clues? <laughs> Always does. Mm. Always does. Yeah, this is All my right. Side. Let's see what happens. Ten passwords arranged alphabetically, starting with the letter A. What's A? A. And going all the way alphabetically through to J. What's, is that J? J. J mm -hmm. like that. Very good. Okay, you get 10 of them in 60 seconds and you have $5,000. What's $5,000? $5,000. dollars $5, That's what That's you get. That's what I want. Yeah, okay. <laughs> and what's that again? That's, That's what I want. Okay, all right. Okay, remember the first word starts with A. There you go. That's the first word, Richard. All right. Okay, you're going to have 60 seconds. Good luck to you both. Go. Uh, siren. Ambulance. Um, a clock. Alarm. B. Uh, tree. Birch. Tropics. Um, bamboo. C. Church. Chapel. D. Uh, antiperspirant. Deodorant. E. Uh, pain. Uh, clue. Remedy. Excedrin. F. Uh, football. Uh, clue. Uh, area. Field. G. Um, oats. Grain. Herbert. Hoover. I. Shot. Injury. Uh, drugs. Uh, injection. J. Uh, Mary. J uh, jo John. Uh, yeah. Yeah. won seven thousand five hundred dollars wow. i don't think i can all right i'll say it you won seven thousand five hundred dollars and you get to play again let's go all right we have a new player I think everybody agrees with me. Billy Stransky's a great champion, and I really appreciate your signing like that. You may sign whenever you Happy. want to. Let's meet the new no. player, Cindy Sanders. Come in, Cindy. How <laughs> are you, Cindy? You sit right here. Tell us about yourself, Cindy. Well, I'm from La Habra, which is out in Orange County, and I'm married and have two lovely children, and I've spent an active year as the president of their PTA, the Las Lomas Las Positas PTA, and it's been busy and I love playing word games. Good. Well, nice good. to have you here. Thank you. You've got a good opponent over here and good partners. So let's go. Here we go. Brand new competition. First clue in the puzzle. And Richard has the option. Oh, no. Yep, because he has a new player. Pass or play, Richard? Uh, pass. Okay, there you go, Deborah Lee. I'm starting to dislike you. <laughs> <laughs> Ultimate. Superior. Second clue. Being. God. Third clue. Uh, superior. Deity? No. Last clue. Ross. Supreme. Supreme. Uh, that's good. I was going to say that. Of course, might have said. All right, now, Cindy, first clue has supreme is the clue. What do you think? Diana Ross? Is it Diana Ross? <laughs> All right, here we go. Never knew. Richard's option. Pass I'll play. Pass. Okay. Um, Italian. Italy. Second clue. Caesar. Roman? Yes. <laughs> All right, Billy. Two clues up there, Supreme and Roman. Roman. Is it Julius Caesar? Is it Julius Caesar? <laughs> No, but a good idea. Yes, yeah. All right, Deborah Lee has the option. I will play. All right. Deity. God. All right, Billy. Three <laughs> clues up there. Oh, oh, Roman, Roman, and God. Roman, Roman and God. You're rotten winner. Roman and God. Roman and God. Okay, too long. Now we have another one. All right, Deborah Lee's option. Pass or play? I'll play. All right. Biggest, 
largest. All right. Okay. You have four clues. Supreme Roman God and largest. Billy? Is it St. Peter's Basilica? Is it St. Peter's Basilica? No, now the last clue is coming up. Deborah Lee has it. I'll play. All right. Saturn. Planet? Yes! Now, Billy, they're at the bottom of the clue. They know it, but you two are going to have a chance to guess it only. Oh, gosh. Supreme Roman God, largest, and planet. Jupiter? Is it Jupiter? Yes! <laughs> Very good. Okay, we have a tie game. We have 100 over here, 100 over here. We have a commercial over here. When we come back, we're going to play the $200 puzzle. This is good playing this week. Tell your friends. That's okay. It, it does mean, though, that you still have a shot at another hundred and then uh -huh. a $200 puzzle Thank coming you. up. So it's just a hundred and nothing, that's so far. This is the next puzzle. Cindy gives the clues along with Billy. There you go. First clue. What are you going to do, Cindy? Pass or play? Um, uh, I'm going to play. Go ahead. Ranchers. Farmers. Second clue, Billy. Cowpokes. Cowboys. Yes. You did? Yeah, I did too after I said it. Okay. All right, now, Deborah Lee, you have the first clue up there is cowboys. Um, bonanza. Oh, is it bonanza? No. Remember that? Cowboys on there. All right, Billy has the option. Gonna pass or play, Billy? Uh, I'll play. Okay. Comanches. Indians. Yes. Cowboys and Indians. Beverly. What do you think? Cowboys and Indians. Um, games children play. Is it games children play? <laughs> no, but that's a category we've never had. Billy has the option. Probably gave the producers an idea. Yeah, they could use it. Uh, <laughs> you said it, not him. Billy, pass or play? I'll play. Okay. Amusing. Amusing. Um, funny. Yes! <laughs> Cowboys, Indians, and funny. F Troop. Is it F Troop? I don't, oh. I don't know any. Oh, All gosh. Right. Billy has the option. Can I pass or play, Billy? Uh, I'll play it. Okay. Streams. Streams. Brooks. Yes. Right. <laughs> Good very well. One clue, and they get it every time. Cowboys, Indians, Funny, and Brooks. Oh, gosh. Oh, oh they oh. know it. They know it. So watch it. Billy, here you go. It's your option. <clears throat> Pass or play? I'll play. Go ahead. Cinema. Movie. All right. Now you got all five of them. Cowboys, Indians, Funny, Brooks, and Movie. Deborah Lee. How come I don't know this? I probably didn't see this. Um, I, uh, oh, no. Do you know it? All right. Billy it. has an eye. Billy can answer. Billy, you could add. Oh, Billy. Uh, oh, I don't know. I just don't know. He doesn't know. Shall we? We did all of them in the audience. Did we get it? Let's no. know. <laughs> what is it, audience? Blazing Saddles. Blazing Saddles, yes. Oh. Uh, I see it twice. You've seen it twice? I didn't see it. You've seen it twice. Why Mel Brooks. Why didn't you put Cleve on Little or somebody <laughs> oh, like that? And Mel then Brooks I would have known. Oh, was the giveaway. We have a commercial. We still have a hundred or nothing. We'll be right back. <laughs> it's happened again, folks. I have to share it with you. We have a contestant here on Password Plus, a thing that's been happening more and more since we've been playing Password Plus. Uh, Cindy, how long? How old were you when you... Where were you when you first started watching and playing Password? Grade school. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. And where were you? A little bit, uh, around the same place. Around you know? the sixth, fourth or fifth grade, yeah. I guess. I see. Well, it's nice to play a game that is so so established that it can wear on and play just as well right. as it did then. I'm glad now I don't have to sit home and play it. Yeah, I'm glad I you was in with the, you. I was in the cradle. At the I cradle. don't want to hear that. <laughs> they told uh, me about it. Okay. Your mommy told you. Yeah. All right, Cindy has the option. Brand new competition. Pass or play, Cindy. I'm going to play. Height. Tall. Yes. All right, we'll do First game is two, and this is tall. How are you doing? Charlton Heston. <laughs> uh, he certainly is tall. All right, Charlton Heston. No. No. But you have the option, Cindy. There you go. Pass or play? I'll play. Go ahead. Cupboard. Cabinet. Yes! <laughs> well, I tell you now, that is one of the hardest words when you got it in the first word. I'm terrific. You know, it's a very difficult word as a rule. Two clues up there, Tall. Richard. Tall and cabinet. Cabinet. Mmm. Mmm. Charles de Gaulle. A little late, I think, so I don't have to ask. All right. Cindy has the option. Pass or play? I'll play. Okay. Pit. Pit. Pit bull. Pit bull. All right. Dog, you know, a fighter. Second clue, Billy. Clock. Pendulum. Yes. My girl. Good girl. You remember your pull. All right. Now you have three clues. You think you know it? Mm -hmm. We'll give you hundred dollars if you do. It's tall cabinet and pendulum. The, a grandfather clock. Is it a grandfather clock? Yes. <laughs> the other two is time and time. Oh, you always want to win? Yeah, yeah I love it. All right, two hundred dollars over here. This is a two hundred dollar puzzle. Sure, you could tie it up on this, or they could we'll win. Get it. Here we go. Richard has oh, the option. First clue in the two hundred dollar puzzle. Faster play, Richard. Um, I'll play. Go ahead. Titanic. Chip. Second clue. Mountainous. Iceberg? Yes. <laughs> Put it in, Billy. Put it in. First clue. Iceberg. Is it the Titanic? Is it the Titanic? No. That'd have been a little on the money, I guess. Here we go. Deborah Lee has it. Pass or play? Debbie? Um, I'll play. Okay. Faces. Um, countenances. Second clue, Richard. Bust. Sculpture. Third clue. All heads. That's yes. it. Thank you. Mm. All right, did you get it from bust? We had it up. Yeah. That was a good game. Right? A little, you helped a little. No, no those are good clues. Two, putting two All right. Together. Now you have two clues up there, Billy, for the game. Iceberg and heads. <laughs> Iceberg heads. I have no idea. All right. Do you think you have it, Cindy? Yes. You think you have it? Okay. Holy All right. Deborah Lee has the option. Pass or play? I will play. Go. Crunchy. Snow? Second clue. Mm. Celery. Crispy. You take it. All right. We want it crispy or crispy. Icebergs, heads, and crisps. You know it, you think. You could tie up the game. What is it? Lettuce. Is it lettuce? Yes. You tie up the game. The other two, green and vegetable. <laughs> well, what can I tell you? You have a $200 over here, $200 over here, a commercial over here, and we'll be back. We'll play your alphabetics. Can you stand this? Good thing Will Maine wasn't up there. The came in for Gibb, and it comes from Mrs. Jack Swisher in Pekin, Illinois, who says, Billy, the test is not whether you can forgive your enemies, but whether you can forgive your friends. Very good. Thank you very much. Thank you. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Bye. Thank you, Billy.